Hi, I'm Mary Beth Gandy Coleman, a Principal Research Scientist at Georgia Tech. I'm a computer scientist in the Institute for People and Technology. This work that I'm presenting today, Cognitive Augmented Reality, is a collaborative project with NC State led by Dr. Anne McLaughlin, a human factors psychology professor. And together we're working to design and create and test new training systems using augmented reality to work with the human mind rather than overwhelming it. So the overall goals of this work are to support uh, workers and trainees while they're doing complex cognitive and motor tasks. Now we're not creating specific content for specific types of jobs, but rather we're creating a tool that allows the user to reduce their cognitive load and their attentional demands and also enhance their situational awareness by using augmented reality to mediate signals from the environment via a multimodal interface, so visual, auditory, and haptic. So to highlight a couple of projects, one that's currently being funded by NASA as well as industry partners is looking at how can we focus a person's attention while they're in the classroom or while they're trying to, to complete tasks in complex time sensitive environments like an, emer an emergency room. Another project funded by the National Institute on Disability, Independent Living and Rehabilitation Research is looking at how we can support consumers and installers in, in developing realistic, accurate mental models of IoT ecosystems to help them choose products, install products, and maintain them. Increasingly, we have the need for skilled workers in domains such as healthcare, manufacturing, and technology who can perform their work in dynamic physical environments. They must have the ability to assess and manipulate these environments, making complex decisions quickly and accurately the Cognitive AR Toolkit will give these future workers the superhuman ability to control their perception of the world around them, to focus attention, improve performance, and reduce stress.